bless you. Today's encouraging word comes from the book of 1 Corinthians chapter 12. And we will read verse number 14. And it says, For the body is not one member, but many. Amen. Uh, the body of Christ at large, amen, is made up of many members, many member churches, and many individual members. And we all make up the body of Christ. Amen. And it's good to be a part of the body. Um, and if you are a member of a church, then you are a member of a local body. And that's a blessing as well. Uh, but the Bible says that we should not forsake the assembling of ourselves together. Amen. But that we, we should come together in Jesus' name. Amen. With the promise that he would be there in the midst so that we can encourage one another, strengthen one another, pray for one another, help one another. Amen. Uh, within the, the structure of the local body of Christ. And this points out something that's so, so very important. And that is this. That as members of the body, we should be contributing members. Amen. We should help move the body forward. We should help the body be stronger. We should not hinder the body, hold the body back, amen, or keep the body from functioning in the earth realm. And when you think about it, no matter what role you play in the church, whether you're in the pulpit or you're in the last pew, you are yet important to the functioning of that body, amen. It's just like with our physical body, amen. Our, our pinky finger is important to the functioning of our entire hand, amen. The smallest toe on our foot is important to us being able to walk or to run and to carry out the things that God has placed within us. It doesn't have to be the biggest member of our bodies, amen, but every member of our physical body must be functioning, amen, if the entire body is going to operate at peak efficiency and effectiveness. The same is true with the local body of Christ and the body of Christ overall. The members of the body, each and every one, is important. Amen. And we have to fulfill our function individually so that the body corporately can fulfill its function in the earth. So I want to encourage you as a member of the body of Christ to be mindful of the role that you are currently assigned of God to play in the church in the body of Christ, and be faithful in fulfilling it, because as you are faithful in fulfilling your role as a member of the body of Christ, you are helping the body, glory to God, be stronger, amen, and more vibrant, and to go forward and carry out the assignment that God has placed on the body of Christ, corporately, locally, amen. So I want to encourage every one of you who are members of the Christ, be the best member of the body that you can be. Be faithful so that you can help the body be even stronger and to do more for the advancement of the kingdom of God. God bless you. Until next time, be encouraged. Remember, Jesus loves you and his love never fails.